Moving on to the Democratic Republic of Congo, Kinshasa. Check this out. Rush hour traffic is slowly easing up along the intersection of Boulevard, Tugongfal and Hilarious Avenue in Kinshasa. Thanks to the two new robot cops in town, they may not have real eyes, but new traffic policemen still spot Kinshasa's usual signature cop sunglasses. The robots are equipped with four cameras that allow them to record traffic flow. The information is then transmitted to a center where traffic infractions can be analyzed. The team behind the new robots are a group of Congolese engineers based at the Kinshasa Higher Institute of Applied Technique. They say this would help bring order on the roads and bring in revenue. The robot corresponds to international standards. If a driver says that he is not going to respect the robot because it's just a machine, the robot is going to take that and there will be a ticket for him. Yes, so a traffic robot cop. What? That's exciting. You know, I noticed that people there have mixed reviews. Some people love it. Others are not like impressed. But I am impressed, man. As a motorcyclist, I'm very happy with the robot's work. Because when the traffic police control the cars here, there's still a lot of traffic. But since the robots arrived, we see truly that the commuters are respectful. The robot was not made to arrest offenders or act on accidents or other violations of the traffic code. Because if someone knocks someone else, Else off the road the robot is not going to follow that up for real though that is not only innovative but they will be able to save money because apparently they spent a lot of money to manufacture the robots see that many other African countries are moving forward Niger have you guys seen the light rail that they just launched in Ethiopia Jay! You see what I'm saying? Eh? I said to myself, I said, ah, this train in Ethiopia, how much did this thing cost them now? I found out $475 million. See? Eh? And it's been overseen by the Ethiopian Railway Corporation. They did not contract it out. They are doing the thing themselves. How much is our own train construction project, my dear? Eh? Hey, $12 million. See? $12 billion. See? What? Oh my god and we gave the contract to chinese people does that even make sense though we borrowed the money from china and we gave the contract to chinese people so they will make their money back from us plus interest hey and look at what we have to show for it 12 billion except for the air conditioned train in lagos look at what they bought with 12 billion 12 billion dollars and on top of that these people have the guts to tell us that as nigerians we cannot have new trains rails rail system that have been moribund for 20 years i mean you know have been commercials that have never ever worked this admission has revitalized it they have revitalized we lagos see Kano. the pictures of the rails sir. they look like Locomotives from 1950. What does second hand third hand from it. China? We are not America. Why can't we, we have are, brand new? You trains? cannot have brand new trains because you know the economy cannot support that. And besides that, we are using. Why? Well, I thought we, we are, are the largest economy in Africa. Uh, Why uh, we are the largest. You know, we are the largest market. We are the largest economy. It does not mean that all the money is not going to be used to be grand, to go and buy trains and coaches. So where no, look, you know, going? look. You've got the money. Is, the money is being spent. On Nigeria and the Nigerian people. Thank you very much. God bless you. There is a God, Zo. There is God in anything that we are doing. There is a God, Zo. Congratulations to Ethiopia on their light rail. This is what we call light rail. It is a real light rail. This one is locomotive, not light rail, by the way. And also, congratulations to the Republic of Congo for the Robocop. <laughs> it's doing a good job. And not only that, congratulations to Dr. Doyo Okupe. Yes, my brother, for letting us know that we don't deserve new trains because we are nigerians you guys know i don't know anything you know, except the fact that they're able to buy brand new planes for mr president not one not two not three not four not five they can get that from mr president but for the common people nigerians this is what we get for 12 billion dollars oh my god guess what i'm just giving it real